Jack, a massive welcome to Crawley. How delighted are you to get the deal over the line on deadline day? Oh, honestly, I'm so, so happy, so grateful to Crawley, everyone at Crawley, for taking me on this, this opportunity that I'm just so excited to, to take, really. Yeah, obviously you join us from Woking, as I mentioned already, it is deadline day, you know, we're rapidly approaching the, um, the deadline. Tell us a little bit about how the move came about. When did you sort of first hear of the opportunity? Um, I found out about two weeks ago uh, and straight away I was just like, wow, if this can happen, it would be, it'd be amazing for me. As soon as I um, went to Woking, I, w I wanted to get back in the Football League as quick as I can. I feel like my, my, my talents are best, best shown in this league. So as soon as it came up, I was, I was really excited by the, by the opportunity and I was, yeah, wanted to do it straight away. Yeah, obviously, as we said, deadline day, you haven't had a chance to meet the new players yet, but you have had a chance to meet Scott. Obviously, you've been in the building for an hour or so now. You know, what are your first impressions of the club during you know, the very short time you've had here so far? I've walked in, the, the facilities are outstanding. The, the people are really nice, welcoming. I haven't met the players yet, but I already know a couple from my time at Spurs. I knew Nick, Toby, a remedy. So it's just been, it's been all really good. I had a couple of chats with them over the last couple of weeks and I'm just really happy it's all fallen, fallen into place, really. Yeah, we always sort of touch on that in these you know, first interviews, that it's useful for you to sort of know a couple of the lads going into it. You know, it must have been really helpful for you to have had those conversations, as you say, with the likes of Nick, you know, Toby and Aramide as well. You know, sort of what were the messages that they gave you about the club and, you know, how did they sort of sell it to you, I suppose? Um, so when I spoke to them a couple of weeks ago, they just said, oh, like, it's interesting stuff. And then they said that the, the new manager's come in, the gaffer, and he's got them playing really good football, high pressing, and that's everything that I want to be part of. And I feel like my qualities can be shown in that type of type of environment. So as soon as they said one of them things, I was, I was, I was buzzing and... I actually played against the Gaffers team in pre-season, Swindon, and, and we, got, we got played off the park and honestly, one of the best teams I've played this season. So once I knew about all of that, I was just like, it, it sounds like the perfect move for me. Yeah, as I mentioned, obviously you join us from Woking in the National League, but you know, that's not where you spent most of your career, obviously. Some good you know, spells with some really good academies at Crystal Palace and Tottenham. But you've also had some good loan experience in the EFL as well. So do you think it's you know, good for you to have had that experience that you can draw on now you're here on a permanent deal? Yeah, definitely. So I had my time at Cambridge and Burton and Stevenage and all of them, all of them clubs, I learnt, I learnt a lot of things being a younger player. And now I'm, I'm 23, I feel like I can use that, that small experience that I have to, to come and help Crawley and, and, and they can help me become an even better player and with the manager and everything that he's done and doing, I just really want to be part of it. Yeah, I suppose obviously you've touched on it already, but do you feel like this is just like the perfect stepping stone for you and the basis that... As you said, you've had that experience on loan while you know developing your skill set at you know some great academies, and now it's the, you know a chance for you to show what you can do on a permanent basis. Yeah, exactly. Like I, I wouldn't I wouldn't use Crawley as a stepping stone because I feel like I'm very very grateful and fortunate for, for to have the opportunity to prove what I can do. So I feel like I'll use Crawley as much as I can, and and hopefully I can repay them in in the trust they've put into me uh, this on this deadline day. Yeah, obviously, as you mentioned already. You know, you've spoken to some of the lads about the gaffer. He had his first game Saturday, first win for him as well. It's an exciting time to join the club, isn't it? Obviously, we've got owners with very high ambitions. You know, we, we look to be getting back on the track and I'm sure the target for you is just to get get straight in and, you know, help the lads climb the table. Yeah, so I watched the um, the highlights on Saturday and it was like, it was a great performance. Like, scored three goals in the first half and it just, I think it typifies what, what the, the gaffer wants to do, you know, play attacking football. Winning football is the most important thing, and yeah, it, it, it's all looked amazing from everything. From from the outside, it's, it's all looked really good, and especially the last, I'd say, month. Yeah, and obviously you join us at the perfect time. We're heading into what is a massive, you know, game for us on Saturday as we look ahead to Gillingham. We've sold out our first away end for the first time in, you know, one one of the first times since we've been in the EFL. You know, the 12, 13 years that we've been here. How excited are you to just get started on Saturday? Yeah, I can't wait. Like, I saw, when I was driving up here today, I saw uh, Crawley tweet that the, the, the weigh-ins are sell out and apparently the home end is sold out yep. as well. So when I saw that, like, what an opportunity for your first game. If I'm, if I'm included, um, it's just going to be onwards and upwards. I think I'm just so excited to, to see what the Crawley fans are about. I've heard good things from the boys who I know. And, and when I've played here in the past, I, I know they're a good crowd. 
good people, so I'm just excited to meet them as well. Yeah, before all that starts, you've got to get stuck into training. Obviously, Thursday will be your first day, I imagine. I, I can just imagine you're buzzing to get started and meet the rest of the lads that you haven't already spoke to already. Yeah, exactly. I've, I've played against a couple, I know a couple, and you you got to earn your respect, uh, especially at a club like Crawley. You've, you've got to show what you're about, show that you're a hard worker, show you want to be part of the team, and then what comes with that is, is everything else. Jack, a massive welcome to Crawley. We hope you have a great time here. Thank you.